Okay, this is a very quick video just to show you some basic things with creating an interactive worksheet or document. Uh, you could use, do this in Google Docs, you could do this in Pages, um, either one you choose. I like Google Docs because I like the idea that students can get to it very easily. Um, so there's a few things we've already done. One is that Command C uh, to copy, Command Z equals paste. If I want to link something, all I need to do is go and find the document I want to link. Right now I have just happen to have this agenda open. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to highlight this. I'm going to hit Command A just to select it all. Command C to copy. I'm going to go back to my document and I'm going to tell it where to link. And let's say, I don't know why I would do this, but this word copy, I want to link that document there. So I go up here to this chain link, click on it. Command V, once I'm done, OK. And you can see that it went ahead and linked that. So I can go through, I could choose a website I want to link to, um, I could choose a YouTube video I want to link to. All I do is go up, steal that uh, URL, copy it, paste it into the link wherever I want it to be. One other thing is the idea of taking a screenshot, which you've seen in some of the tutorials I've made. To take a screenshot, all we do is push Command Shift 3. You hopefully heard a camera sound. All I do then is go to the, uh, I could go right here to Picture. insert an image, I'm going to choose a file, and that screenshot, it'll be called screenshot, and you can see the time that it was taken. Right there, I see it, I'm going to choose it, and there you go, it's already loaded into my document. I can drag it down to whatever size I'd like it to be. If I want to be able to move it a little more, I can shift it to inline, that means I can just move it around. If I want it to be centered automatically, uh, I can choose uh, fixed. Now you've also seen how you can insert any image. All you need to do is go to here, Click on that. It'll let you open up a file. You can find where it is. You can do the URL, or you can go in and just do a search within Google Docs for a picture. One feature they do not have yet is the ability to insert or embed video into Google Docs. That's something that hopefully will happen at some point. Till then, you will have to just link, just like we did before. And that's how you make an interactive worksheet or document.